Uh, Johnny Depp has no intention of returning to Pirates of the Caribbean. Lit. I thought he was. I thought I saw uh, what's the name where he was coming back. Nah, he no, he said they can eat a dick. <laughs> <laughs> nah, pretty much. He's saying he did, they can eat a dick. So does does the movie do as good without Johnny Depp? Uh, it depends. If they reboot it, it I don't know if it do I mean, it's the same hard. numbers. It's kind of hard to replace Jack Sparrow. Yeah, I know. And, and you can't put in another Jack Sparrow. You got to you got to get a whole new character. Yeah. I mean, what they'll have to do. You can't um, recast him. But yeah, nah, because when the Amber Heard stuff happened, Disney dropped him like a hot potato. Mm-hmm. And he was just like, I'm never going back to them. Fuck them. But she hit me. Oh, yeah. yeah. Which so, is, that's, that's his point. Y'all just dropped me. Yeah. And without any proof or anything, she just wrote a thing and now, I, now I, I'm out of a job. So if they was at, so he's basically saying if they was to come with all the money in the world, and I still wouldn't do it because basically they just shit on him. So he's like, fuck him. Yeah. I can't blame him for that. Hmm. He'll get more opportunities, hopefully. I don't know. Spend, why spend why not? Do you think, you think this trial gonna do him like they did Will Smith? I don't know. Like, who don't do drugs? <clears throat> as long as he ain't touching kids or like, you know, taking advantage of women. I don't see the. I don't see what Johnny Depp's big issue is. Because people, they only care about the initial thing. Yeah. And they never really. She hit me. <laughs> yeah, but they only care about the fact that she said he hit. He hit her. And yeah. You got to prove it, though. I mean. You don't. You kind of do. Public. You kind of don't. Yeah, you no, do. No, you don't. That's usually how that's how some of the stuff goes sometimes. Yeah. Which if is you, some people's beef with it. If a girl say that you hit her, like, you can go to jail for that shit. I, I mean, mean, in like, Hollywood, though. You like, just have uh, the stick if you're, if you're doing a defamation of character lawsuit as of right now, and it proves that Johnny Depp didn't hit her or strike her in any physical abusive way. Yeah, Doesn't hope, that kind of clear him everything? Like, I would everything hope should so. Go back to normal? Like, I would uh, hope so. Some but. drug allegations. Hey, who don't do drugs in Hollywood? I would hope so, but I don't know. I don't know. It's like once you get that, like, once you get that, that, that dirt that, on you, it's hard, it's hard to get it off. Stuck. Even if it, even if it finds out like you didn't do shit, it's like some people are just gonna be like, "Nah, he did it. He just didn't get caught." Yeah. Then I didn't do it. I went to call for this double jeopardy. Can't can't try me again. Yeah, but then they might not want to hire him for work and shit. That's what mm-hmm. I'm saying. Like the possibility is still there. Be right. Yeah, I mean, he's. I, I hopefully I feel like. I mean, he, he ain't Trey money. Songs. He ain't got multiple allegations and stuff. It's only one. No trigger. Trigger been out here. Wild, Wild yeah. ding. Rory. And academics fuck the same bitches. Absolutely. <laughs> they fuck the same women. That's nasty, too. Because well, no. It is, because academics said this shit two months ago. Yeah. And then Rory said something. Yeah, and then Rory said the yeah. same exact thing. I'm like... Well, isn't that kind of what their beef was about? They know somebody yeah, similar, yeah, yeah. and then Ak was, allegedly... Ak was suck up fucking one of his side bitches, or and something. told on Rory. Some yeah, and like allegedly that, yeah. he got... I mean, again, I don't, this is the story that I've heard that I have no idea is <laughs> any substantial weight, ain't proof that it's true, but he like... Got Axe address and left him oh, yeah, no yeah, in his yeah. thing, whatever. So because they know, so they know people. I mean, the industry, them damn women. I feel like it's small. So I like, I feel like small circle. They gotta know it's a circle. A lot of it's a circle. <laughs> I asked this question on Twitter. I need some women to answer. And I don't know who I'm gonna ask, but mm-hmm. you know, that's 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 uh, here. Mm-hmm. I, don't, I don't know if they, I don't know if they're still in chat, but I mm-hmm. I said the way that Trey songs acts yeah. towards women is that women's fault? Huh? Oh, but no. what do you mean? No, the no. way that no, no. How? What, pulling the titty out? Yeah. No. I'm just saying the way that Trey Song acts towards women yeah. is that women's fault. No. How? And I mean the way that uh the way Trey Song's like a sex symbol and how he's been heralded as just like sex guy for many years and mm-hmm. like just him getting implanted in his head that every girl wants him because he's seemingly been been hearing that his entire career, so he feels like he can go up to any woman, just do whatever the fuck he wants. That's a personal problem. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm saying I'm, I'm not that, saying it's a widespread. I'm saying like in Trey Song's head, he thinks he can do whatever he wants with me because they quote unquote want it because every woman likes him. That shit happened with BB Rexa like four or five years ago. They they were at this party and he cornered her. And I guess they was both drunk or whatever, and she was just like not into his advances at all. He was like, "Yeah, I know you want it. I know you want it." And she was like, "No, I don't want any of this." Mm-hmm. And I feel like just because he's been hearing this from fans or just women he slept with, like his entire career, like the internet, he's just been hearing this since forever that he, I, I want to fuck Trey Song. Mm-hmm. And I just feel like he feels he can do anything to women, and it should be no repercussion because every woman wants me. Yeah, but I, would, uh, I wouldn't put the blame on women for that. Yeah, because you would have to. T- have to put the same thing you said on Harvey Weinstein. Yeah. No, that's not the same thing. <laughs> <sighs> because I'm Power sure... Power position and women telling me out their mouth that they want to 
do all these things to me isn't the same. Well, Harvey Weinstein is like, sure. hey, I have power. I can put you in position. It's him. I'm pretty <laughs> sure he's been in rooms where women was like, yo, I want to fuck you just because you're Harvey Weinstein. You have money. You have the cars. You have the hotels. You have the lifestyle. I'm mm. pretty sure he's been around women like that. So if you put it on Trey, you would have to put it on him. But Trey is a little different because, you know, he's a sex level and shit like that, which I understand. Mm. Still his fault, though. Yeah, I wouldn't put the onus on women. That's his brand. That. He came out as a sex symbol. But I feel like women fed into that stigma or that Yeah, but I feel like there's a lot character. of people who have been quote, 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 unquote, like sex symbols who also weren't doing any of the things that he's doing. No, I'm not saying that, so that I, a, so like, that's why I think it, the responsibility. Think like that, you just do the thing that he's done. I'm just saying in his singular case, I still would put with the up. way that women have been treating him his entire career. I feel like he feels he could just do this to any woman. It's just like it's a go because every woman wants me. No, I just that's think his fault. I just think he, that is his fault. I'm just saying, is it women's fault that he mm, thinks like that? No, no, it's his fault. He thinks like that because yeah. he's thinking it. It's not the women implanting that in his head. Yeah. Well, it's just him so because he's from it. Virginia, he got issues. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? that? Sierra said no. That nigga from Petersburg, VA, and had dusty cornrows. He got <laughs> issues. <laughs> dusty These men are still at fault for their actions. That, they are. At, they are. At, exactly. They are at fault for their he's actions. A, he's an adult, and he made those decisions. Regardless of what someone someone could tell you, oh, you're very attractive. Doesn't mean okay. Now nah, I'm gonna just try to finger you now. Yeah, no. Didn't <laughs> thing. Like, but I'm just saying, like, if, I'm gonna try if, a bowling ball. But if this, I'm going like parking lot, because if, if I'm cute. going ten for ten, when it was like, hey, if I approach a woman and you know I make these sexual events and it keeps happening, then I go to another city and I'm ten for ten there, and it mm-hmm. just keeps happening year after year after year, and then maybe every once in a while I might get a no. Trying but she, to fuck somebody and then groping them are not similar things. Well, just saying. I, I I'm just saying there is a distinction. Mm. between trying to have a conversation with someone to lead it into sex and even being super forward about all you want is having sex and then groping another human being without their permission or not the same thing. And you know that happened in Connecticut too, right? I believe it. I, but that doesn't... So my, my only point is that's all on him mm-hmm. because there's many of a dude's who are probably no, it is an by, ego trip, but I'm just saying who have been told by women, oh, you're so attractive, blah, 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 who aren't doing the same things and don't have the same exact response from women that he got and weren't doing the same things that he was doing mm. that so i'm just for me that is all on him i wouldn't put any blame on any of the women just for telling because just because somebody tells you you're attractive doesn't mean you have to grope people that's what that doesn't give you no i'm not not attractive but or like they like, or I'll, like I'll, women I'll, I'll like give him you. sexual yeah. advances like trey so i'm pretty sure trey songs yeah for the for those most part of his career hasn't had to work for pussy for Man, those particular women yeah mm. but what about the women who aren't giving you those same advances? he can't di- he, so he has some so ego how, issues where he can't differentiate which is on him. him. I'm not saying it's not on him. I'm just saying the never mind. No, I, never mind. <laughs> Forget it because I can't. I can't explain it the way I'm thinking it. Okay. right yeah. now. Because <laughs> <laughs> now it just seems like I'm an advocate for Trace. I'm like, no, it's not. It's not, <laughs> no, it's not, it's not his fault. No, yeah. Yeah. it's just a question. But yeah. I, <laughs> I will say this though because I kind of have experience with this. You remember all those uh, stories we were doing about you know these Twitch. These Twitch yeah. streamers, these YouTubers getting caught up in allegations and shit mm-hmm. like that. It got to a point to where I started to feel sorry for these niggas because they never really actually had to go outside and experience like talking to women. Like mm-hmm. all this shit is, interaction is online, right? I had this conversation with um this girl I was messing with. Like she came down here, she flew down here, and we already established that we was fucking. Mm-hmm. But even though she's in my house, I still have to court her in order to do that. I can't just go up and just do it. Yeah, and we had that conversation yeah. afterwards. She was, she was like, yeah, like, um, even if I said it online, there's two two different personalities. Yeah. No, there's one you, online. You have a woman naked in your bed. If she says no, it's a no, nigga. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. But my thing is, like, you can talk as nasty as you want, because I see this a lot on Instagram. Motherfuckers be like, well, we was in the DM when she oh, said yeah, she was going to suck my yeah, dick, yeah, so yeah, yeah, and then yeah. when you get in person, like they it's just whip not, it out and shit that's like that. That's what happened to me. Like, yeah. It don't work like that. <laughs> yeah. That's, don't the, work like that's that. the exact same shit happened to me. I was talking to this woman, and I went over her house, stayed over her house, slept in her bed. I had only known her like three weeks, so mm-hmm. I didn't try nothing sexual. I'm mm-hmm. like, you know, I'm just chilling, not trying to yeah. you know, start nothing. Then like, a year later into re- into the relationship, she was like, "Yeah, I thought you was gay at first because <laughs> you ain't trying nothing." I was like, "Oh, so I'm trying to be respectful, respectful. not trying to, you know, consent and I'm, whatnot." Yeah, I'm just, not even consent. I'm just or like, just... I only know you like three weeks. I mean, I'm in your bed. That don't mean we need to fuck. I'm just yeah. going to sleep. <laughs> I didn't know you want to fuck. I, Grab a dick or something. I don't know. I've been in that, but I don't know. It's a way of working into it. Like you start kissing this shit, start touching it. it Gotta get the rhythm. Nah, we spooned. He just went to sleep. <laughs> I was just like, I wouldn't. 
I didn't try. I like, I thought you was gay. Now I'm gay. <laughs> cool. Now I'm gonna show you I'm not gay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you gay. <laughs> <laughs> Told you all around this fucking room. <laughs> oh Jesus. But I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Trey Songs was not on, on the topic list, but you know. Uh, man. Just, yeah. How we get here again? <laughs> Johnny oh, Depp. Talking about? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's crazy. Go from shitting in beds to fucking groping people. I mean, yeah. hey, Trey Songs is never going to work in this industry again. Uh, we'll see. Tw- Yo, he has more of the. Okay, there's 20 women that are out right now. I'm pretty yeah. sure there are way more. Trey Songs has been out since we was in what? A freshman know. in high school? You see how long it took for him to get cows? Mm. It's your book, yeah. it's a, it's a They had that nigga on Tizzy. Yeah. But it's a different time, though. They had that nigga on Tizzy. I feel like m- women are more. Going drip. drip. Susceptible. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no, I believe you. No. <laughs> it's a different time, so we might expedite the, the thing faster than it, it was compared to when R. Kelly shit was going on. Mm. So I, I understand what the point you're trying As sad as that is, I, I think it depends on the person. Yeah. Well, That's true. It doesn't depend on the situation, it depends on the person, yeah. unfortunately. How much people like you. Yeah. If people like no, Trey, no. Trey ain't going nowhere. Yeah, I mean, it all depends on, on your and, last hit. And, <laughs> and it depends on what comes out and how much he can they can spin it to make it not seem like it is what it is. You know what I mean? If there's any wiggle room, and they're going to wiggle it. So if he has good lawyers, and if they can wiggle it enough to spin the narrative. It's your problem. You're wiggling it too much. <laughs> wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> Do you think, do you think there's anyone that can avoid jail? Can it, what? What do you, do you mean? Like with oh. the, with all the shit that's going on in Hollywood now, because like they say, like status, money, uh, shit, damn near your like your skin color could just keep you out of jail. Is there anyone above jail at this point? Like no matter like the wildest allegation about them come out, is they like uh, this person is just above like the system? Yeah, yeah, I don't know. It depends on. You think what Jeff Bezos can go to jail? It depends on what it is. Yeah. You think Elon Musk can go to jail? It depends, depends on what it is. Depends on what it is. If he murders somebody, probably, like straight up, like oh, I went to Starbucks and shot fourteen people. He's probably going to jail. I mean, I mean, not. I mean, shit, but again, I like clear cut shit like well, that. That's we got what I'm you saying. on tape. Yeah. You want the camera saying, "Hey, I'm Elon Musk." Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm talking so, about that. I'm just talking about like you know, just some groping allegations. Maybe not. Yeah, like he's probably got enough money to like make that go away. Or 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 settle or, it, 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 I think it's it's situational. It all would depend on on the circumstance and the situation in which it is bred. <laughs> Down out here, almost getting me too. <laughs> 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 I'm just trying to be a sensible human being. Just like, hey, I'm not gonna, you know, try to put my dick on your butt on the third week of knowing you. Just want to actually know your last name and what's your favorite food, what's your favorite color. <laughs> I just be trying to know people. I gotta uh, try. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> If you in my house and we got a vibe, like, I'm how could try. You, how could you be gay because you don't sexually harass me? <laughs> it. Hmm? Make that's, it make sense. Uh, yeah. You got to talk mm. to women about that. That's, yeah. that's their thing. I, I, appreciate, I appreciate guys that don't do anything. I respect it. They not gay. I'm t- that, that, then, that's then, you saying that. Yeah. Uh, a lot of women be like, nah. Bobby R. Kelly still got people saying he is innocent, which is true. I know. Uh, watch out for St. Bill Murray. Yo, shit, don't <laughs> fucking bring up Bill Murray. Yo. Yeah, nah, Bill I think he was walling uh, recently. Bill saw, Murray? Yeah. yeah some, I don't I didn't look in the article, but I, I saw, saw stripes. That nigga might have been wild. I saw something like recently he was on on a set being inappropriate. I don't know what inappropriate means. Mm. That nigga got dementia. Yeah, all right, man. No, mm. Don't do that to Bill Murray. Bill Murray old as hell to have dementia. Bill Murray gotta be at least 112 right now. I mean, he's probably like 70 something, but <laughs> Bill Murray? He's got <laughs> have you looked at Bill Bill Murray look at he, least he's 92. White. He probably 80. All right, 80 something. Bill, Cause, cause if Bill Murray's old, he's either forty, right? Probably, I would assume something. I feel like there. Bill Murray was like thirty when he. If he's strikes. older than eighty-five, I'd be surprised, but he might be. Bill, maybe, maybe he is. Bill 80, James 86. Murray is he's probably around Michael Keaton's age. Seventy-one. Yeah, seventy-one. Oh, shit, that's what Jesus. I thought. Jesus, yeah, he, he looked like that. He white. Mm, they age yeah. different, like milk. Yeah, in that's the why sun. I drinking lactate. Oh, <laughs> uh, milk in the sun, a hot rock. <laughs> That's, on a, <laughs> that's one of our rewards for slavery, I think. <laughs> that's one of the rewards. Yeah, I wasn't. Mm. Mm. No, we going to age y'all super fast. <laughs> you? Plus, that, also, that armor God. also, also, if he was hanging out with like, uh, uh, in the SNL, like in the 80s, he was doing hella coke, nigga. <laughs> hmm. Hella coke. You think Johnny Depp was high? Maybe. Probably couldn't touch Bill Murray's nose. I don't know, but... <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> but you can't pull that skin back and you know just no he's he's good he's just living his life being a wizard and shit <laughs> being a wizard <laughs> ghost busting and shit sniffing the yay